great athletes are great athletes, no matter how they treat their body. Now, they might age quicker than they would, but when they're in their wheelhouse, doesn't matter how they take care of themselves. Their they're, they're, uh, hand-eye coordination, the quick twitches from the brain, that's what makes them great. David Wells was Babe Ruth, and he pitched a perfect game. He wasn't Ruth. He, he might have lived harder than Ruth. I mean, he was more mantle than Ruth. I don't know. Well, well right, he went out of party. The story about mantle. The stories here about mantle. How would he do? He would not be a Hall of Famer. He would not be a Hall of Famer. Mickey Mantle wouldn't century. be a Hall of Famer. Mickey today? Mantle would not be. A Hall oh, of you're out of your you mind. The guy this, ran three. So you won you, the first base. So you think in this day and age, you can go out and party and have the life that Mickey Mantle yes. had and succeed in the 21st Absolutely. century? No. Done. No, but the why isn't anybody like doing it now? How do you know what people do off the field? How do you know? It just doesn't seem... It just, first of all, they didn't work out 24-7 the way they do today. Mantle, what you think, was Mantle swinging a bat in November? Was he working out? Was he was he was he getting checked out by a doctor constantly? I, I no, him. he wasn't. I, he. I, those guys were selling insurance during I the off season. You. Mickey Mantle was. I love you. You're wrong on this. You're wrong. No, but his competition was, was. His competition 1, was three point one to first base from the left-handed batter's box. That's so he was That's fast. a god-given I mean, gift. And he was speed strong. Speed is speed. He was stronger than anybody it, of his but, day. But there's no way in this day and age going up against the competition that you're going up against that you can go out and party till 6 o'clock in the morning, get two hours sleep, and go out there and hit three How home do runs. You know that what these doesn't guys work do. today. How do you know what these guys do? What are they, they all They just boys? don't, Michael. No, you're around them, Michael. It just doesn't work out. Now, do they party on occasion? I'm sure they do. But I'm th the work ethic is just a lot different. You can't get away with what you used to be able to get away with back in the day. There's more pitches now. The guys are working out more. They're, yeah, this, they're, this, they're more conscious of their abilities and their health more than they were back in the day. This take from, is strong. From, from what I can tell, okay, the difference between today's athlete and the older athlete is now today's athlete orders in, if that makes sense. That's a big difference. That's a big difference. But they, they order in. They're not going to be out until 3 in the morning trying to find but somebody to have fun it's with. It's the same with football. It's the same with football. You, went, you would go to training camp, or in baseball, you'd go to spring training at ground zero. All right? You hadn't done anything for three, four months, and then you would spend spring training to get back into condition for opening day. These guys are working out all off season. They're conscious of what they're putting in their bodies more than they ever were before. Unfortunately, some of them may be a little too conscious of what they're putting in their bodies. Obviously, the ones that break the rules. It's just... Oh, I'm good. not insulting those guys. Those guys did you, what was necessary to do Mantle. back I mean, in the day, little... but it's completely different now.